So important. Adam, thanks again. Well, now to COVID, Imperial County has one of the highest COVID death rates in all of California. News 11's Wiley Jahari joining us from El Centro with more. Yeah, so far, more than 800 people have died in the valley as a result of the pandemic, and that number still expected to go up. COVID-19 is still a major threat across the Imperial Valley. And now doctors across Imperial County say the region has one of the highest death rates in California. But at some point we were, were seeing uh, four to five um, during the week and daily um, pass away. So it's, it was fairly high. Dr. Adolf Edward with ECRMC says this is not a good sign. People need to take this seriously. A lot of folks are saying, oh, it's... You know, Omicron is just flu-like symptoms. You're good. No, you're not good. It's still a, a virus infection. It's still as infectious as ever. The health department says the only way to combat this surge is to follow CDC guidelines. If you haven't uh, gotten your booster and you're already eligible, please seek a vaccination site. Ask for the booster. Um, masking when you are indoors, uh, please wear your mask. Angulo adds there are no new cases of the Delta variant, but 12 new cases of the Omicron variant have been reported in the last week. As for Dr. Edward, he says we may not see the light at the end of the tunnel anytime soon. We're hoping that we're going to turn a corner. We keep talking about turning a corner. I don't know when the turning of the corner is, to be honest with you. And medical health experts say that many individuals with COVID are still showing up to be asymptomatic. That's another reason as to why the case rate is going up. I'm Wally Jahari reporting from El Centro.